So the goal of the one week class is that people come here and they get a great introduction into traditional square rule timber framing. And we use pretty much exclusively hand tools, which makes for a really nice atmosphere, a quiet atmosphere where we can hear each other. And, uh, and you really get a good understanding of how wood behaves with cutting tools, chisels, drills, saws. Um, and the larger goal of the class is that you would leave feeling that you could tackle the creation of a small timber frame structure, a shed, or uh, a small cabin. We've actually had a student leave this class and go cut a 30 by 40 barn. He was an unusual student. You don't have to have any previous experience and don't really need to bring any tools <laughs> other than uh, just yourself and a desire to learn. The first day tends to be very intensive, uh, a lot of demos and everybody learning how to read the plans and understanding how the square rule system works. And then we do a demo of a mortise and a tenon and a demo on how to lay out and how to safely use a variety of tools. In the evenings we have slideshows and discussions on engineering and design and, and uh, any questions that the students have. A lot of times different students have a project in mind so they'll bring questions or even blueprints or a sketch on a napkin and we'll use those to kind of get the design discussions going. We have a wide variety of students who come here, some who have been working in construction for a long time and some who have never done anything in the construction field. We have um, everything from high school students to retirees. One of the nice things about teaching at Yes Tomorrow is there's a higher estrogen to testosterone balance than at any other school that I teach. And, uh, and it's fun to have um, that variety in our classes here. I really appreciate that about this place, that it's welcoming and open to people of different skill levels and backgrounds. It's a very, I find it a very friendly and diverse place. Well, speaking specifically about Josh and Skip, um, they have a real magic and they just have such a chemistry. Um, they're not just great timber framers, they're great mentors. They really take the time on the individual level to get you where you need to be and they, they somehow monitor everybody's progress and they're just, they're just amazing guys. Once we get down to using a chisel, I think that's my favorite moment because we're, we're splitting pencil lines and it's affecting how this very large scale structure is going to go together. So everything that, that Josh and Skip and Yes Tomorrow has brought forward um, in this experience is just invaluable. And on the last day of the class, we erect the, the frame that we cut during the week. And usually we erect it on site where it's going to stay for the next oh, 300 years. <laughs> well, one of my favorite parts of teaching this class is always the raising. It never ceases to stun me that we can come together with a group of 10 or 12 total novices. And at the end of a week together, we can put up a a small building and the joinery looks good. It's amazing. <laughs>